Anyways, um, so here's here's my big tell, like big giveaway when it comes to telling all these um, these bot stories, not bot stories, fly stories. Whenever you stumble upon a fly, you don't just use a fly swatter. Use a spray with you, a disinfectant spray, you know, just whatever it is, because, mm -hmm. like, they're gonna get caught in it no matter what. When they get caught in it, it slows them down, and that gives you the opportunity to hit them faster. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, like, so there are times I would spray on them and they would fall down. Pow! I would just swipe the son of a bitch. Note to self. Yeah. No, like, I would, like, as just... This is just something I would tell everybody. Like, they would lock me in an asylum and shit. Like, son, you don't just <laughs> use a flash water. You need a spray. That will stun them. That's your sword and shield when you're dealing with flies. <laughs> Love how we I love how we went from the days of fucking bees and now it's flies. Oh no, like okay, bees comparatively, like, yeah, no, I used to have annoyances with them, but that was just because of the games. In real life, I hate flies so fucking much. And like obviously everybody else does too, but the thing I hate about them, they're entitled to everything in this world. They act so entitled that they just lay their eggs and think they could do what they want. But what's worse in our ecosystem they spread their bacteria. And yeah, yeah, same thing can be said for mosquitoes, but flies are just so much more obnoxious. And just... They spread them everywhere. Uh, the only purpose they have in our, like, in society is be food for frogs, birds, and spiders. That's all they I'd are. Rather go ahead. I'd rather not have any of them. I mean, sure, but what would they eat? No, I mean, I mean, the, I mean the mosquitoes and the flies. I mean, yeah. sure. I'm not going to, like, I'm not going to pick your poison and go, like, oh, I'd rather go for this or go for that because there's a pro and con to everything. With mosquitoes, they're easier to swap. You just don't want to get bit by them or stung yeah. by them. Mm. Which, when you one think thing, about it, go ahead. One thing that helps, though, is if you have a bat in your area because, like, bats will eat mosquitoes at, a gr at an amazing rate at night. Mm. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Well, they're, they're, yeah. Sorry. I was just gonna say, like, there are some species of bats that special, like, their main appetite is mosquitoes. Because uh, something about the, something about the way the mis, uh, the, the I think it's like protein related, and bats eat a lot of protein. Yeah, and when I... you have so many of these fuckers around. Yeah. Na natural pest control. Yeah. Yeah, nature's pets. Nature's pest control. <laughs> also, I posted a clip in a right. in the in the gaming chat. It's something that happened <laughs> when I was in watchful stream. <laughs> Apparently, I just I had a very psychotic oh, it's this laugh. This son of a bitch. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh -oh. Okay, uh -oh. so this is a particular SU mo uh, fighter. Um, yeah! <gasps> this dude is one of the top flighter, uh, flyers. To Alright, where is he? Where is that son of a bitch? Uh-oh. Ah, Mihale. Yep, there he is! <laughs> there he is! Get him, get him. Oh, um, since I've been playing Castle Crashers for a while on my Switch, <laughs> I already, I'm already in the ice area. Ah, that's right, that's the, damn it! Fuck, okay. Yeah, that's the one with the Ice King. Yes, he was an obnoxious shitbag. No, the thing I remember the most is that after we defeated him, I kid you not, like, um, there's, a there's that thing where everybody fights each other to get the, uh, the woman. Uh, I was first yeah. killed, Solar, uh, not Solar, but Logic was killed. Literally, Wolfhead was going right up to the lady, going all like, Hey, so, uh, do you, and Solar just comes in and decapitates him. <laughs> I remember that, I remember that was in your highlights, and I was like, Well, you have no one to blame with yourself, Wolf. <laughs> and then Wolfhead ended up with the clown. Yeah, no, that was a great ending. Oh my god. That was, was like, 
More specifically, that's Tricky the Clown on Newgrounds. Yep. Yeah. Like, that is that is yeah. beautiful. Oh, I got him. You got him. Got that. Well, he he took a hit. I didn't take him down. Oh, see, oh no! Oh yet. no! Oh no! I think I'm I'm think I'm stalling. <laughs> Especially at this type of place. Oh god. Oh oh! He took another hit. You didn't see it coming, did you, bitch? Did ya? Let's see. Well, let me tell you, when I was facing against the corn, I was like, stop moving, you son of a... Oh yeah, no, the the corn sucks. No, the corn took way much. too much punishment, like, holy shit, dude. Yeah, I was like... It was like, we get it, you don't want to die, that's very unfortunate. Come on already. Yeah, really. I was like, I was like man, now I know how you guys feel when you were facing this guy. <laughs> And you were all teaming up. Ooh. I was by myself. I was playing this game by myself. So it was like... So like, jeez. This is hard. It's hard to play by yourself. You know? Oh. Yeah. Oh, is he turning? He's turning. Indeed. Oh, I'm gonna turn too, bitch. I'm gonna try to get on your fucking tail. Come on. Come on. Lock on, lock on, lock on, baby. Come on, lock on, lock on. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, damn. Warning. Warning. <laughs> All right, there the son of a bitch goes. Warning. Oh, uh, come on. All right. Oh, 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 he took a hit. Hey, nice hit. All oh, right. Yeah, okay, so okay. he's right around the can, uh, the canyon area. <sighs> On you piece of shit. Yeah, damn it. All right, you want a gun? Let's gun, bitch. I cast gun. <laughs> Come on, you son of a bitch. God, he's so agile. Well, it's probably because of the jet he's driving, uh, that he's controlling. No, it's, it's because of his there. fucking skills. Oh, that it's not, too. It's, uh -oh, it's not you the plane hit. you're flying, it's the pilot. Fair, that's fair. If you've seen Top Gun Maverick, you would understand that. I have yet to see that movie. It's I don't know if I will good. be. It's fucking good. I heard a lot of people say it's good, so I might consider it someday, but it, probably not with my daughter. I, It'll probably be one of those that best be play, best be watching by myself. Alright, uh, that's fine. Okay, that son of a bitch disappeared. Where'd he go? Wait, I think he's retrieving. He's chickening out. Yeah, he's fly away, bitch! <laughs> I own you, motherfucker! Right, He's back. trying to make a break for it! Biggest dumbass in the unit. Said that's so sassly. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I wouldn't get involved if I were you. <clears throat> Are we landing? Yep, I think we're landing. Alright. <sighs> also, for, uh, for Kingdom Hearts 4, there is at least one world that I am hoping that they will put into the game. I'm hoping. I can only hope. Okay. And that world... And that world is Treasure Planet. I would love to see... Like, as much as I'm not a big fan of Kingdom Hearts, it would be cool to see Treasure Planet get some love. Dude, I would love to see Atlantis become a part of Kingdom Hearts. Like, I would try... Like, if that happened, I would legit try to play through Kingdom Hearts again. And probably use a strategy guide, because I can't figure all this shit up on myself. That's why I don't like the Fair. game. It's just... It's cryptic, and I hate that shit. 
it can That's be fair. very cryptic and like bring you new shit out of nowhere with no uh, explanation or really i mean unless you like look at the step by step in the in the uh brief explanation yeah. of new abilities and stuff it's like still yeah. yeah so i know that there's obviously there is an audience why am i fucking saying that <sighs> <laughs> Thoughts on the website Dal I d eh? oh no, I'm not even gonna look if it's a cursed image. I still oh dear! How many times I I fought that Riku battle as a kid? Oh, from the first game? Yeah, when they didn't have the the skip cutscene option. Oh yeah, I remember that. It is I, Ansem. The thing I'm oh, the God. thing I remember. From everyone else's frustration was Demix, especially hearing Josh going, all, yeah, da, 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 dance, da, 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 dance. Uh, uh, Don't remind me! <laughs> God, Demix, I hate it. it. It's when you have to fight against his, like, water clones that's the worst because you gotta kill them all in, like, a certain amount of time, and it's like. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, the data battle, especially. Okay, I don't mind him as a character. It's just battling him in general is what makes it annoying. That's the only thing. I don't mind the character himself. He's he's a he's funny. He's a comic relief. It's just when you have to fight him is like, "Oh my god, you're the most annoying character I have to fight. Why?" <laughs> Let's see, what other ones that was, like, a pain in the butt to fight? I'm trying to remember. Ah, oh, there were so many of them. Ah, bother, I can't remember. Oh, bother. I can't remember. I can't remember what other... I can't remember what other bosses that you have to fight in the Kingdom Hearts series that was also annoying as Dimmix. Hang on a second. It, please tell me, is there a Winnie the Pooh world in one of the Kingdom Hearts games? Oh, no, yeah. In most of them, yeah. Actually, yeah. yeah. Most, okay. And honestly, okay. like, they're they're mostly mini game segments, but they're charming because, like, the Winnie the Pooh series is just charming in general. Honestly, I don't get the people oh, yeah. who don't like it. Oh yeah. Yeah, really. Like Winnie the Pooh is just one of those things you just cannot hate. It's a charming, fun franchise that it like it it's, looks like it's mostly targeted for little kids but it's got that particular genius behind it you know kind of like the dr seuss books where yeah they're a lot more adult than you give it credit for oh yeah oh yeah also tigger's the best i love tigger he's my favorite the wonderful thing about tigger yeah, I... tigger's are wonderful things the tops are made out of rubber their bottoms are made out of springs they're fancy fancy fun 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 and i can't remember the last bit except i'm the only one the most wonderful thing about Tiggers is, is, is I'm, the I'm the only one. one. I'm, I'm the only one. one. Alright, uh, I, I have a I double uh, er, gut. See, I double gut. Er, that's that Tigger. Uh, yeah, like, it's like Winnie the Pooh is one of the purest things on, in the world. Yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. You can't even get angry with them. You're just like, oh. Except for Rabbit. Except yeah, for rab rabbit. <laughs> like, yeah, like rabbit is one of the reasons that my philosophy is I'm all for freedom of speech, but some people should just shut the fuck up sometimes. <laughs> yes, because oh hooray, I guess Tigger will just stay up there forever. Fuck yourself, dude. It's like look, I understand that he's like disruptive of your gardens, but don't you ever talk to him at first? No. You don't even do shit. Yeah, I don't remember, but I think out of all the characters, Rabbit was my least favorite because of how he treated everybody. I don't get his reasoning of like what he's supposed to symbolize in the series. Cynicism. To... <laughs> I mean, tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> I mean, personally for me, I feel like Rabbit is supposed to represent the... Whoa! Shit! Christopher Robin. Specifically. I think oh, that. Oh, okay. You're supposed to blow maturity the and growing up. It's uh, I could see that being that, like, he's supposed to be the realistic character. Ah, I see. 
I've not seen the Christopher Robin movie, but I know I'm gonna ball my eyes out when I do. Same. Dude, I, I love got... the Christopher Robin movie. Like I haven't seen it yet either, but I'm like I'm gonna be crying my eyes out if I ever see that movie. No, I did my too memory... because go ahead. My memories. Well, I don't know. I have a hard time watching that film nowadays because it's kind of associated with a certain memory. But I'll, I'll try. I'll probably... I liked it. I thought it was pretty good, honestly. I remember when uh, my my mom. My mom is a huge Mary Poppins fan. So when she got to see the movie Save uh, Mr. Banks, oh, I think that's what God. it's called. She cried in that movie. I'm like, wow. If you get a movie that makes my mom cry, that's that's a huge accomplishment. Because <laughs> she's the one that rarely cries. She's yeah. like that... That's the thing about her. She's a strong woman, and she rarely sheds tears. So, it's it's very rare for her. But yeah, seeing that Mary Poppins, her most favorite movie, one movie that makes her cry, I'm like, well, I'm screwed. If she cries, I'll be bawling my eyes out. <laughs> oh no, 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 no! Oh god, I was stalling for a second. I was, I'm really, really close to the ground. Oh god. Oh, that's right. There's going to be two Pinocchio adaptations going ahead. To we head. were talking about that earlier. Yeah, oh, one of were. them is going to be involving Polly Shore because of course Polly Shore has to no, come no, in. No, 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 not that one. No, the uh the one the Guillermo del Toro one and the uh the Disney one. Oh yeah, the Disney one and of course Guillermo del Toro. Still yeah, one of the how it turn out? Go ahead. Same. I was just going to ask, isn't Tom Hanks playing as Geppetto in that movie? I think that's a no, good casting one. choice at this point. Like, I have full respect for Tom Hanks and a lot of roles that he's played in, you know? Oh, yeah. It's a safe choice, honestly. Oh, yeah. and, like, honestly, I... it's the safe kind of choice that you just, like... I can't even be mad at if it's, like, a quote-unquote safe choice. Yeah. Yeah. He's been, what, Mr. Rogers, Walt Disney? He's... Yeah, he was Walt fucking Disney, and he did his performance so good. Well, but he's he's played a role in a chunk of my favorite movies, like The Green Mile, for instance. He played a lot of roles. There was also um, ones that's outside of Disney. Well, I mean, of course he's played a lot of roles outside of Disney. He was in Big, uh, Splash. Forrest Gump. I'm one of the very few people who hate Maze it. Mazes and monsters. <laughs> oh, for a second, I thought I was going to crash into a pole. Y'all ever heard of mazes and monsters? I don't no, think I haven't. No, I don't think I have. Basically, it was a... It was an anti-D&D propaganda film from the from the 80s. Uh, oh. <laughs> Tom Hanks. They must have paid you at least good money, I guess. It was oh, one of his man. first roles, if I remember correctly. Uh, oh, really? It kind of reminds me of the time when, um... <sighs> when Foo Fighters were unfortunately part of a, um... Did the music for a, uh, a documentary that basically said AIDS wasn't real. Oh, yep, no! I remember that. Yeah, Foo Fighters was part of that for a while, but they but they obviously got out of it. I would mm -hmm. hope so. Yeah, they did get out of it. I mean, for fuck's sakes, um, Dave Grohl was at a foof, was at an AIDS awareness um, festival with um, El um, Elton John, if I remember mm -hmm. correctly. <clears throat>